want you guys to decide. Do you guys think that my subscriber got my hair to be curlier? Or not? Hands around my neck. Hey guys, what's good? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Brianna. Thank you guys for being here. So today's video is going to be, I'm actually been trying out a subscriber's recommendation for a hair routine. So this is actually what she does. And who this is, it is actually, her name is Ellie. L-E-M, um, that's how she has it on YouTube. And what she did, she actually just commented, was, if you're watching this, Ellie, hello, thank you for this um, recommendation. I'm super excited to try it out. What I literally did is I went, took myself to Target this morning. Well, first, I ordered it on my app, and I did drive up because I just love drive up. So I took myself to Target earlier this morning, and I went to go get the products that she recommended, and we're gonna be trying them out today. But I do wanna show you guys a comment of what she said and like what exactly we're gonna be doing today. So she said, I can get your hair curlier. And this is from my Diva Cut video. Um, she commented this on my Diva Cut video. So she said, here's the steps. Shampoo and conditioner, already did that. Rinse out, already did that. Now we're gonna go into the styling process. She says, then leave-in conditioner, Kinky Curly is great at Target. Got that. And then she also says, run it through hair while, run it through hair while it's wet. I have to wet my hair to run it through it. And then a curl cream, plenty from Cantu or any other brand. So what I actually did is I got um, two from Cantu because I wasn't sure which one it was but I don't know if it's just you guys or not like if you guys buy Cantu do you know if they have seals on their products or not because when I got it earlier they have no seals on them so I thought that was kind of weird I mean they're fine but still it's, I don't know it's kind of weird they don't have seals so this one is the moisturizing curl activator cream and this one is the coconut curling cream I think I'm actually using this one this one smells really really good so I probably might go with this one but I don't know we'll see when I start doing it and she also said then your gel run through and scrunch through wet soaking hair. I use Aussie Instant Freeze. You want a gel cast. I got the Aussie right here to the Instant Freeze. And she says, let it air dry 70%. That's gonna be hard for me because my hair takes a really long time to air dry. But we're gonna see how that goes. And she says, then diffuse and scrunch out the crunch with an oil. So shout out to you, Ellie. Thank you for this idea for this video. Super excited to try this out because I don't really try a lot of new hair products out as far as like styling products for natural hair. So we're gonna see how this works today. I'm a little nervous because again, I don't really like try a lot of styling products out. So we're gonna see how this goes. All right, so uh, my hair is clean. It has nothing in it. And two. Start splitting up my hair, and then I'm gonna wet my hair as I go, just so that it's soaking wet while I do put the products in. Let's get this started. She said her hair is exactly like mine too, which is cool, because I love when you guys tell me that you guys have like, the same hair texture as me, because I could never really find someone who had my hair texture on YouTube, so that makes me happy, it really does. Okay, so this is the first piece. I'm a little nervous, because I'm not used to like a bottle. If you guys get what I'm saying, my leave-in is usually like a spray bottle, so. We're gonna see. Oh, this smells good too. She said, run it through hair while it's wet. I'm gonna do it section by section because if not, I feel like my hair doesn't all get um, all the product. And then she said, a curl cream. So, which one am I gonna go with? I have no idea yet. Ooh, my lips. <laughs> Whoops. I don't know, this one smells really good. I really like the way that this one smells, so I'm gonna use this one. I have a feeling that I should use the other one, but I'm not sure. So I took a little bit of the coconut curling cream. I am just distributing distributing that through my hair. Have you guys seen the Lover and Friends concert that is supposed to happen? I am so excited. I honestly, I really hope that it's real because I wanna go. I would like love, love, love to go. So I'm hoping that it's real. I really, really hope so. Because if not, that's really sad. A lot of people are like really excited. I'm really excited about it. Like there's not really that many concerts like that anymore. So I hope it's real. And then she said we should say, and then run your gel through and scrunch through wet soaking hair. All right, that's what we're gonna do. I'm a little nervous to use this because it says alcohol in it. It's not like at the top of the list, but it's in there. Um, which alcohol does dry out your hair. That's why like a lot of hairsprays that um, dry really fast have alcohol in them, like the top, one of the top ingredients. I'm not gonna put a lot of the gel. I'll probably go in like after when I'm done with everything and put a little bit more gel, but I just, the gel scared me a little bit. But she did say that you, I want a cast. I'm just gonna take a little bit more of this. gel it says instant freeze gel 20 hour max hold 
I don't know, we're gonna see. <laughs> All right, so this side is completely done. Uh, my dear, 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 dear camera decided to overheat. That's why we are on this side already. Um, but I don't know how this is going so far. I mean, it's fine, but I don't know how it's gonna look when it's, gonna, when it's dry. We're gonna see how this goes. Which one do you guys prefer? Let me know down below if you guys have used the curl activator or the coconut curling cream and which one you guys like better and also what your hair types are um, because different products work different on everyone so I'm just curious because I don't know which one I should be using but the coconut one smells better so that's how I want the coconut one. Oh, I almost forgot y'all. I will say with any products it's super important to um, wa really wash your hair and clarify it um, with like a rinse like an apple cider vinegar rinse is really good or any like shampoo that does have that in it is really good like a clarifying shampoo I feel like everyone needs one of those in their life because it will prevent your hair from having so much buildup because then it's not gonna look good it's gonna be weighed down um, it can lead to a lot more issues so definitely invest I really invest because you can find one at Target um, I actually bought one at Target that I really like because I ran out of mine and I needed it like ASAP so I actually got the Aveeno one it's an apple cider vinegar rinse and it's really good don't ever 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 brush your hair with nothing in it at least have a leave-in in it or something in it that has a little bit of slip because it can lead to a lot of breakage and we don't want that we want nice strong hair here so put something in your hair before you brush it out it'll honestly make the job so much easier too rather than like you fighting against your hair don't I'll also link this um, bottle down below in the description box because I got a lot of questions on it last time. So we can be doing our hair without hurting our hands. I also just put like the rest of the product right here because I don't want it to get frizzy. It's on the last section, finally, at last. I couldn't wait. All my hair like goes in. Um, someone commented. Someone commented that they were a stylist and they said that like all natural, wavy, curly, whatever it is, that a lot of them, they go into the face, like towards the face, which I thought was kind of weird, but I did notice that. I was like, well, why doesn't it go away? Because every time we, like everyone curls their hair, they do it away from their face, but you can tell it's natural if it goes forward. Don't quote me on though, because I don't know if there's people who their curls or waves go outward. And don't come people saying that their hair isn't natural ever because I mean, it's not nice when you do it and it's like, their hair is natural. Cause then it's like, just don't do it, it's not nice. I'm gonna flip my head upside down and just add a little bit more gel everywhere. I'm all done with the styling process. Um, I have to wait until my hair is 70% dry. 70% dry. So I will see you guys in a couple hours, hopefully sooner because I would like to just fuse it out. Just so excited to see how it's gonna come out. I'm kinda nervous though. Let's see what Miss Ellie says like on what temperature or how long I should have used it. Let me see, one second. Um, all right, so it says let it air dry and then diffuse and scrunch out with an oil. All right, all right, so she just said, sh 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 what? <laughs> all right, so she just says to diffuse it and then scrunch out with an oil. So I'm not gonna diffuse it, it's gonna take me some time. Hopefully not too long because it's ready. Somewhat dry, this is how it's looking right now. Okay. I'm gonna diffuse my hair now. I'm done diffusing. Okay, so the last and final step that Miss Ellie recommended is to finish it off with an oil. And pretty much what the oil is supposed to do is to help scrunch out the gel, that's what she said, like a gel cast. I personally don't have a gel cast. Let me tell you why. Because I was very scared <laughs> to use a lot of the gel. I was very, very, very light-handed when I went in with the gel. Because I was scared. I don't want to have my like hair looking really hard even though I know like you can scrunch out a gel cast I know that but I was just really scared so now I know I can put more next time but I think my hair looks good I think really like the way that it looks okay so I'm gonna finish it off with this oil this is the organic girl hair co stimulating scalp beverage and I'm gonna take a very little amount of this so I'm gonna take a tiny bit and put it into my hands and then just scrunch my hair with it I don't really have a gel cast like I said earlier before but this is going to help seal the ends. And my hair looks good. Look at my hair. I think it looks good, to be honest. Look at this all under here, too. All right, so here's my hair right now. I'm going to do a full little 360 for you so you can see. 
It's not 100% dry, it's about like 95% dry I would say. For the final verdict, I'm gonna go ahead and put a picture of the video that Ellie commented on saying that she would, that she knew how to get my hair curlier. It will be right here and I will be right next to it so you guys can see how my hair looks right now. So now that you guys can see my hair side to side with a picture right here and this is my hair today with Miss Ellie's hair routine. I wanna know, comment down below if you guys think if my girl Ellie got my hair to be curlier than in this picture right here. Let me know. Comment down below, give this video a thumbs up. Honestly, this was super exciting to film. It's all available at your local target well i don't know if it's like available at everyone's local target because then you know like some targets have different stuff but you get me you get the gist of it so thank you guys so much for watching this video definitely give me a thumbs up don't forget to leave your comment down below saying if you think that ali got my hair to be curlier or if it was you know kind of the same so i hope that you guys enjoyed this video and i will see you guys in my next video